Okay, welcome once again. I'm still working on the keys and the notes, especially on the instrument called keyboard or piano. Yeah, we understand as musicians, musicians, that uh, there are 12 keys or 12 notes. So this is what I'm going to explain now so that we remove the mystery of misunderstanding. So here is the way to show all the 12 keys that you hear people talk about. It is within these keys that a person can sing a song, can present a song, can write a composition and sing within that one of the 12 keys. So here are the keys. I'm going to draw a diagrammatic view of the notes on the keyboard and illustrate them. So if this is our keyboard here, we can have something like this. Continuous. So we have So I'm going to put the notes. This is C where we have the two sharp or flats. I'm calling the note below C. So this is C, D, E, F, G, A, B, C, D, E, continuous. So let me show you what sharps and flats are. The black key to the right of the key immediately. The black key to the right of the key immediately before that key. We call it sharp. The black key behind the current note is called a flat. Remember? A B, I mean, uh, a C, this one, doesn't have a flat. And if it has a flat, it's an imaginary flat, which means C flat will be B. And at the same time, E, rather, F, F doesn't have a flat. And it, if it has a flat, then it will be an imaginary flat. Therefore, an imaginary flat F is just simply E. Uh, but when you look at G, the flat of G is the black key immediately behind this one. So this is G, G flat. But I've said the very first key to the right of that particular note where you are, toward the right, we call it sharp, when it is black. Like look at F, the black to the right. You see, right is this direction. And this direction is left. So what I'm saying is this, G to the right, this is called what? G sharp. But to the left, this will be F flat, which means that G sharp is the same as F flat. G to the left is G flat, meaning F, F sharp is the same as G flat. A to the right is A sharp. B to the left is B flat. C to the right is C sharp. And D to the left is D flat. Meaning, C sharp is the same as D flat. This is therefore C sharp and it is therefore what? D flat. This is C flat. It is also known as B sharp. B sharp. End of story. Now I want to show you the 12 keys. They are C, if we use the sharp. If we apply the sharp, then it will be C, B sharp, D, G sharp, E, there is no E sharp, F, F sharp. G, G sharp, 
Shop e A Shop. Uh -huh. Then we come to B. Let us count and see. This is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Un, deux, trois, quatre, cent, six, sept, huit, neuf, dix, onze, douze. If you are uh, thinking of French. So this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Those are the twelve keys that you must come across. If you are a musician, you must know this. Any person, anybody who sings any song must apply either of these. You are singing an E. You are singing an F sharp. You are singing a G sharp. This is considering the sharps. But now let's consider the flat. So we shall say C. What is the flat there? G flat. E flat. E. F. After F, we have G flat. Then G. You see, G flat is to the back. Before you have ever seen. We have got A flat, then A, then we got B flat, then B. Let us count. Let us count, not count. Check the pronunciation. <laughs> so this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One is missing. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One is missing. Which one? Because we have C, D flat, E flat, E, F, G flat, G, G, G flat, G, F flat, A, B flat, B. Which one is missing? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. What is missing? C, D flat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You notice that D is missing here. Yeah. <laughs> C, D flat, then D here. There is D flat, and then there is a D. So there are many keys. One, two, three. There is four, five. This is four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. 12 keys. So when we talk of keys or notes, we say they are 12 in number. Best way can be shown with the circle of keys like this. I divide into 12 portions like that. 3, 4, 5, Let's say Father, Christmas, Jesus, Jesus, and Holy Boy. You know what's coming, right? B or B. So you can see how many they are, starting from zero. I'm going to take all one, two, three, clockwise, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Looking at that, you can count clockwise or anti-clockwise. That is how it is read. Goodbye. Until next time.